Fatty acids can be separated into two categories, omega-6 fatty acids and omega-3 fatty acids. Omega-6 fatty acids, which generally increase inflammation in the body, are typically found in foods such as vegetable oil, nuts and eggs. Omega-3 fatty acids, which generally reduce inflammation, can be found in oily fish, seeds and dietary supplements. Our research looked to see if there was a relationship between these fatty acids and certain disorders of mental health. Over 3,800 individuals were assessed for psychotic disorder, depressive disorder and generalised anxiety disorder at age 17 and at age 24. During these assessments, blood samples were collected and we measured the levels of fatty acids in those samples. We found that 24-year-olds with mental health disorders had higher levels of omega-6 than omega-3 fatty acids compared to 24-year-olds without these disorders. We also looked at a specific type of omega-3 fatty acid called DHA, which is thought to be particularly important in the brain. We found that 24-year-olds with psychotic disorder had lower levels of this fatty acid in their blood compared to 24-year-olds without psychosis. When tracked over time, Adolescents with higher levels of DHA at age 17 were 56% less likely to develop psychotic disorder seven years later at age 24. This could suggest that DHA in adolescents may have a potential preventative effect in reducing the risk of psychosis in early adulthood. We don't yet know for sure what is causing this effect, but it could possibly be related to reducing inflammation or decreasing inappropriate pruning of brain connections during adolescence. We now need to do more research to confirm our results and to learn about the mechanisms behind this effect. We hope this will lead to insights into how we can better prevent mental disorders such as psychosis.